Hey, you all right? Are you feeling okay? Good, because this is Nick at Night. And week now, up there with Ellie Mueller has a whole lot of surprises for you. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. A whole lot of surprises. You just got to watch the word. Find out what's going on. Fabrice, what else we got? After tonight's episode, get ready for wonderful voice impressions by Mr. Microphone. He is really good at doing multiple voices. That guy should get an award for that. Seriously. Interrupt tonight's program up. Let's party up with Joey Headphones as tonight's episode of the Headphones Hour is about the music styles that are just super duper awesome. Yes, indeed. The beat goes on on Nick at Night. That's right. You heard me right. The beat will go on. And that's the way we like it. That's the way we like it. Nick at Night. Late Night Television is is quickly going downhill. So why not uh, spend some time with someone who knows how to make Late Night TV better? I'm Ellie. This is we up. Let's walk. From the YouTube dog show, Bobby and Liam Hemsworth, uh, wherever he calls it nowadays, it's week up there with Ellie Mueller. And now, man who thinks that Liam Hemsworth's career was over right before it could even begin, Mr. Ellie Cunningham Mueller! Ha! Welcome to week now update. I'm Ellie Cunningham Mueller with Summer Grass Office. You know who makes the uh, the theme song and the previews and the bumpers, right? Baby I'm Creations, Dive and Dark Cammy, and of course, Rocky Bull 10 aka Fabrice Wolves, right? Alright, cool. Got that call up. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, we got that uh, taken care of. Got you all caught up on that. Let's do the shouts while it wins, alright? Specs Barkin with the fan edits, we can dojo with the streams. Once brought right up and comes Rayo Jingles channel with the Rayo Jingles and whatnot. Monster Jam Fanatic, Hot Wheels Fanatic, and Supercar Fanatic are all things on wheels. Matt Explorers with uh, some animations and Ty Ralph McKay animation with some animations as well. Okay. Now, what's up? What's up with Liam Hemsworth? He, he, he can really mess things up. Hey, it's a fact. He has shown himself up as the human torch for the Fantastic Four movie. Really? Hmm. Marvel's trying to get all the divorced kids on board, huh? Mm-hmm. I figure that much. He has been trying... Um, he has been trying to have a good career for a while. Of course, his old divorce made him a recluse. He didn't want to do any new movies. Remember, he even moved to a warmer place, too, just to get away from everything. Wow. I don't know about you, but I think that he really needs a clown. Yeah. He really, really needs a clown. Well, I got Mr. Bones and I got MP, so it's time for the top eight list. Let's see what this one is, huh? Okay, what is the category tonight? Tonight's category, top eight words that Liam Hemsworth loves to, likes to say. Number eight, armpits. Number seven, stinky. Number six, yikes. Number five, pool. Number four, nature. Number three, skunky. Number two, eggs. Number one, sweat. Why does he like to say sweat all the time? I don't know, but the way I see it, <laughs> He is a pretty weird guy. You're telling me. Thank you, boys. Thank you very much. We'll be right back. Kids still call it the week now update. Now, here it is. Your five tonight. And now for the weather. Here's our weatherman, Al. Al? It's going to be hot! Thank you, Al. This guy is not going to work. Climate change! Ah! <laughs> Nick 
You know, some people still think that if you want new carpeting, you got to pile in the car and rush around from store to store. Well, you don't have to do that anymore. Not today. Today, all you have to do is pick up your phone and call us at Empire. We have the same brands you see in the stores. The difference is, you stay right where you are, and in 72 hours, you got your new carpet. Best of all, right now is our giant new warehouse sale. So leave the car in the garage, huh? Call us. 2005, you know, with all the characters and things like that, so, what's all this new again? <coughs> Excuse me. As for whether or not he's going to uh, be in the Marvel world, I guess we'll have to wait and see. However, there is one note that we got to uh, talk about. Uh, there's one thing that we really need to talk about, and that is the fact that his career has been, you know, muddling through ever since his recent divorce. Now, we're not going to mention, uh, you know, why, because you already know why, but, okay, he got uh, divorced from Miley Cyrus, okay? I'm not going to uh, pretend that, but, you know, and I'm sorry for mentioning that, but... You no, know, I had to because it's true and you know how it is, right? But, there's a reason why uh, I mentioned that, okay? 
ever since that public divorce. Alright? You know what? Uh, people have stopped uh, calling him. You know, he has been more of a recluse. And the movie scripts uh, stopped uh, coming to uh, his door. So I guess you could say that, you know, uh, as far as uh, being uh, a celebrity and all, he's not really a celebrity. And I think that people were giving him uh, movie scripts because of Miley Cyrus. You know, and I'm sorry that uh, it had to be that way, but that's Hollywood for you. And on top of that, you know, he and his brother Chris are no longer uh, too close. You know, and I'm like, wow. And the bond, one of the strongest bonds that you have uh, gets broken. I, I don't know what else to tell you at this point. I don't know. And on top of that, check this out, okay? You know, this article uh, hopes that uh, he'll be able to get out of it soon. But, apparently, he'll probably be in the work for a long time. Because, as it turns out, he has moved to Byron Bay, full, uh, full time, excuse me, you know, in other words, he used to be in Hollywood, now he's uh, gone back to uh, Australia, and now he's uh, going, uh, now he's living in Australia, well, good luck to him, I guess, you know, but, Wow, it's been what, a few years since uh, that uh, took place? Man, that, no, Liam, for crying out loud, just forget about the divorce, all right? You know, and stop being so much of a reckless. Actually, kind of think of it, you know, ever since, uh, you left uh, Hollywood and things like that. Well, people have been uh, ignoring you. So, what can you do? What can you do? So, I don't know. Well, that's it for tonight's program. Thank you so much for uh, tuning in and, and doing what uh, you normally do, which is, of course, tune in and then laugh. You know, I appreciate that. It really makes me feel happy. I'll see you back here tomorrow, okay? That's the news. I'm Alskis. Farewell, bye, farewell. Hello out there, Mama TV land. Don't adjust yourself.